Well, hey, family. Happy Monday. Um, I'm stopping by real quick because I'm sitting here getting ready to make a couple of chokers uh, before I start my day job. Happy Monday. Um, somebody had asked me that. Uh, Darlene, I don't know what your other job is, but um, yeah, but is it, and if it's related to what I do for Jury by BDK, and I'm thinking like with the magazine and everything too, um, it's all relative. It all kind of runs kind of runs together. Um, it, it all kind of runs together. But anyway, she ended up buying all six of the chokers. I did videotape the last two, but I'm not going to show the video only because I like the way those necklaces came out and I don't want to share those designs. Those are like really unique, very different. Um, some really jazzy stuff I did to those and I don't want to share <laughs> those two. I don't want to share. I just like the idea of some things, you know, not being videotaped because I did videotape them and I was like, well, do I really want to upload or do or not? I said, nah, you know, every, everything don't get to make it to, to YouTube, but she did, she did really good when she saw them. She lost her mind like always. So she did grab them all up. So those are gone. Um, and I was working on some other, some other pieces, uh, some bracelets and stuff. So I, I was working on those and working on the, the magazine. No sooner than I finish one magazine is time to work on the next month. So I'm done with September. That digital magazine will go out um, this afternoon. I'm going to do an email blast for that and send that out um, to all the subscribers. In addition to that, if you are in the Jury by BDK Creator Zone, um, there is a link to the PDF as well as to the Flip magazine. So you can get a not, well, yeah, for the members, it's a sneak peek. But later on today, everybody who is a part of that, um, who is a part of that uh, on the email list will be able to get a look at uh, what's going on. So September, let me see, October, November, December, placement opportunities are, opportunities are available for October, November, and December. And I'm figuring out kind of like a theme I want for the upcoming months. Like I know November, December is around holidays and stuff. And I don't know if I really want to put holiday stuff in there. I might put one or two like ideas or, you know, something like such, but not a bunch of holiday stuff. I just, that ain't really my thing. So, and just because most um media outlets do all that. that that don't mean i'm gonna be doing it because i mean it's just not my thing and i'm gonna do my best to try to stay as close to who i am as uh, possible i like these beads these are the 30 millimeter beads and it's almost like the bigger the bead the better so these are the 30 millimeter and i'm trying to see if i want to do a nice amount of these i think i will i'm gonna put maybe six of them two, four, five. Let's put six of them. Um, I'm going to do more of these because the 25 millimeter, I don't have a whole lot of these. So what I was, my plan is to mix these together and then see what it comes out looking like. So I do have six. You know what I might put? Let's put eight and then see what we get. I'm going to do eight of them because I do like that polka dot look. Oops, oops, oops. So I do like the polka dot. Shoot, this would be nice just with the polka dot like that. It would even be nice as a bracelet with a bunch of, uh, with a bunch of charms, like big, pretty, just charms all over the place too. But in this case, it's going to be a necklace. So we're going to do that. Um, and then let me see. I still, I think I still need to put more of the 30 millimeter only because there's not very many of the 25 millimeter. I think I got two, four, I got six. So if I have six of those, let's put one more 30 millimeter. Oops, wrong. Well, that don't matter. Two, four, six, eight, ten. So that's 10 30 millimeter beads. And then I want to try these 
stripe beads and these are 25. So the beads are gonna get smaller. And then I wanted to try it with the wire, the wire bead. Just to kind of break up. Okay. I do like the way that looks. Just the way it all blends in together like that. And then, now we're going to put our, our little 25 millimeter. I hope everybody is doing well. You guys had a really good uh, weekend and stuff. A couple of people had emailed me too and was uh, checking on me because they know I live in San Diego. Well, actually California, San Diego. And um, they were just checking because of the storm. So the tropical storm did come through. I don't know what it looks like now outside, but I do know it rained quite a bit. Um, I didn't hear like actual storming, like really bad and stuff. Um, the biggest thing, what will probably happen here in San Diego is a lot of flooding. That's pretty. I love the way that matches together. Um, it Generally, it's a lot of flooding. So anytime there's flooding, that only means that there's a lot of uneven ground. Um, and you can drive through San Diego. There's a lot of dips. You know, you could just tell surfaces are not flat surfaces where, you know, the water can just run into the, the drains and, you know, that type of thing. And anytime you paying a little bit of money to get things done, it's, it's going to always be that way. You know, it's going to always be that way. But And I do know Mission Valley floods like really bad. So it's probably flooded. I do know up by, um, is that 30th and University? Uh, North Park area generally floods uh, right there around 30th. And I think that's university that floods, but it's probably just flooding all over the place right now because a lot of rain did fall yesterday. This is gorgeous. I really like this. Uh, let me try it around my neck. Yep. Yeah. Perfect fit around the neck. That's pretty. I love the way all the beads match in. And I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to close it off with, I got some nine millimeter beads that I painted. I'm going to see what this looked like on the end. So that we we did pretty good. When I say we, I'm talking about me and my family. We all we all did pretty good. Everybody is okay. Um, everybody post up. I was in the store. Um, I think it was on Saturday after I met um with the missus. Um I was in there buying some what did I go in there to buy? Allergy medicine. So I went in there to buy some allergy medicine and I was looking for sunflower seeds too. And the lady that works there said, well, everybody came in and pretty much bought up everything. And I was just like, well, everything? She said, yeah, like water, um, tissue paper, batteries, you know, like everything. And I'm like, wow, that's stuff people should really already have in their homes. But I guess... All right, so, and I'm not going to use all this wire. What I'm going to do is I'm going to clip this because I'm going to make a pair of earrings. So let's cut that off. Oh, and then it's coming off on the end. So I do like the way that came out. Came out. And then I'm going to just go ahead and fold this like I always do. And then I'm going to wrap it. By this time, you don't even need to see my, my fingers, I don't think, because you pretty much know what I'm doing. I'm wrapping. I got my round part. And then I'm wrapping. And I'm not going to use all this. Well, yeah, I'm going to still clip it. I could use it for But we did, we did pretty good. I mean, it wasn't as bad as, I, I don't think it was as bad as what they were saying it was going to be. Maybe it was in different areas, but not for us. It, it was, you know, it was regular old. It did seem like it was a little bit more rain than what it normally would have been. But other than that, um, we did good. This is really pretty. I like this. Uh, let me see.
Yeah, pretty good, pretty good. I like these chokers. I think I'm going to be making more of these. And it's not really even a choker, I guess, because it's not. Well, I guess it would be. I'm just in love with these 30 millimeter beads. I know that much. I really like these, and I think I'm going to make some necklaces that have uh, something hanging, maybe a pendant hanging. I might even do some, well, not this particularly, but maybe the 30 millimeter. And then what I'm going to work on is some, um, I really like the way this turned out. This is really pretty. The beads. Just mixing all those beads in together like that. That's really pretty. Um, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna prop. I'm gonna try to do that later on this week. I'm gonna try to uh, do some two strand and maybe three strand necklaces, but not with these bigger beads. It'll probably be with the twenty millimeter beads. I'm gonna work on a couple of a couple of those because I was asked about two strand and three strand. Um, a lady had reached out to me because she was considering wholesale. Her and her daughter, they sell at different events. And I mean, she has a really nice little setup too, like really unique, very different pieces and things. She sent me some pictures and I went to her website and, and saw everything that she does. I mean, like really, and what she sells is pieces from other people's collections. So she buys wholesale and her business is literally set up um, from, you know, purchasing from other vendors, like handmade, like you and I. And when I looked at it, I was like, wow. Her, and it's not just jewelry. It's like some of everything, like candles and sculptures and um, wall art, like just everything. It was like walking into one of these, like, you know, just eclectic type by the type boutiques. I mean, like really beautiful stuff. So she was asking me about wholesale and, um, you know, what I would charge for wholesale and different things. So she did go to the fair website. So I'm going to talk to her uh, later, if not today, maybe tomorrow. And then I'll see which pieces she wants. She does like the big beaded necklaces like this. Those ones were just the long ones. I think what, what length are those? Anyway, the long ones and all the different style beads. So she was looking at those and she was saying she wanted about 20 of those. And then there was some other stuff she wants. So I'll talk to her later and then um, we'll work that, work that little deal out and stuff. And then she can, you know, buy them. And then I will give them to her at a, you know, pretty good wholesale price, like a starter type situation. And then if they sell well for her, which we know they probably will, then when she comes back and she buys more, she's aware that the wholesale price is going to be increased. So it's basically like um, tester. So you can buy 20 of them and they'll be like tester. Whatever she's buying is like tester. So she can, you know, see if they sell for her. And if they they will sell for her, then she comes back and she buy more, but they'll be at a, at a higher price. But anyway, that, that's that. Um, I do love the way this necklace came out though, right? So I am going to be making more of these. I really like this. Really, really, really like this. Um, and they wear really well. They lay nice and flat on the chest. Um, when the missus, I'm calling her the missus, uh, Mrs. V. I'll call her Mrs. V. When Mrs. V tried the necklaces on, they literally, the way they just lay flat on the chest, I mean, they're gorgeous. They just look really pretty. So then she said, well, Darlene, um, did we make any earrings? I said, Miss Ma'am, you didn't ask for no earrings. <laughs> you just asked for the jokers. I'm like, uh-uh. No, I didn't make earrings. You only asked for chokers. So that's all you got. You only got the, the necklaces. But she was happy with, with the ones that we got. Um, and she did end up buying six. I did make six. I videotaped. Um, two I didn't. Everything don't go on YouTube. I don't be wanting to put everything on YouTube. You know, sometimes I want to keep some stuff to myself. But anyway, family, guess what? Um, I gotta go. And everybody have a really good productive day. And guess what? We'll talk.